Welcome to Area DMG. Welcome back to Area DMG. I'm your host, Phil Wesley, the Mile High Mouth, and today we're going to check out um, this game called Shalnor Legends Sacred Lands. It was cheap. Okay, so this is my. Um, let's see, audio. Hmm. Let's see how this is. Is there a difficulty for the game? Blah, blah, blah. Hmm. Okay, let's see how this plays. So, another has come. You are young and beautiful. What? I feel like this is not speaking to me at all. Um, okay. Judge my misguided actions. Yup. Okay. Illigard. Oh, actually, this doesn't look too bad. Let's see what these buttons do. Okay, so I don't have any items or anything currently. Red Marsh. I probably need some weapons, though, to be perfectly honest. Hmm. Well, we don't have anything to do that. Hmm. Let's look for a sword. Is that a sword? Can I take that? Is it, ooh, I'm a ghost. You are not afraid. You are very brave. Okay, go ahead and pick up the sword. It's not like I need it or anything. Okay, B to strike the sword. Dealing with the buzz. The L to... Oh, okay. So this is pretty much just a Zelda clone type thing, right? that. Oh well. Try this one. No? Okay. I guess I literally can't do anything with that. Well, we could chop these. one moonflowers this just kind of feels mostly generic to be perfectly honest it's one of those cheap little games that's often on sale and it feels like it was made with like RPG maker or something like that I got a lot of items. Let's get more of these items. Is it kind of open worldy? I don't know. We'll find out. Oh. Hmm. Can we do these? Yep, we can. Awesome. Wait, what? Okay. Hmm. Oh, I don't have enough money for that. Well, you know what? Maybe I'll go make enough money for that. Let's see. I'm guessing you probably use those types of things for some type of crafting later on in the game. 
it'd be a real shame if you don't. Games like this remind me that almost anyone can make a game nowadays. Sort of. I mean, there's all sorts of tools. And this feels like it was made with those tools. Like it's someone's student project or something. And they just kind of expanded a bit after making like maybe one level or something. Hmm. Our style's not bad. If you're a fan of retro looking RPGs or, or action RPGs so far, this is probably a good idea. Yeah, generally though, I'm finding it to be kind of, um, okay. Let's do this and upgrade our sword. Hmm. Okay, cool. Good to note. If you aim this way, you can cut through both of them at once. But you have to do it a certain way. There we go. Nice. But yeah, there's um not a, there's not really a scarcity to any of this stuff, is there? So far, anyways. My guess though is that that's all for like crafting of some sort later. Maybe you can make healing items or something with it. Makes sense. I do like that it hasn't really told me where to go or anything. So I can appreciate that. Huh. Haunted Crag. Hmm. My guess is we need something before we can go further. Yep. And I'm right. Illigard. I wonder which one of these we're supposed to go to first. Hmm. Oh, so I have a charge meter. Just realized that. Hmm. There's really no music, is there? And that's kind of a shame. It's trying to be atmospheric. And it just comes across as dull. Graphics wise though, this is totally a game that on like say the Game Boy Color or Super Nintendo, I would have been like, yeah. Ooh. Such barrels. Press A to interact. Oh, I don't have whatever that is. Oh well. So nothing here. Let's go into this. This is obviously the first level. Or not? I don't know. Now what? Hmm. Okay, so none of those or the thing that I needed. Hmm. Hmm. 
Okay, so, um, I am legitimately don't know where I'm supposed to go. Hmm. Maybe something this way. Let's keep looking. Angola jungle. I don't have an item that that needs. Let's read it again. Oh, so main main character's name is Rhina Silverwind. Okay. Wow, that's a thing I can't do anything with. Awesome. Okay, let's keep looking. Want to find some enemies, but so far I haven't found a thing. Heck, I'm not even sure where I'm supposed to go. I wonder if I can afford some of those upgrades. Probably, but we'll leave them alone for right now because we just got blood leaf. I don't know what that does. I don't know what any of this stuff does. Hmm. Oh wow, there's nothing over here either. Nice. So, this is pretty much a game where... Wait, so then the place, huh? I have a feeling, blah blah. Okay. So, my guess is we need to get to those places and get, I guess, four jewels. But we need to figure out, like, how to actually get to them. Hmm. Let's talk to this person. There is a hidden chest somewhere inside the cave to the northeast. Okay. Huh. Good luck finding it. Okay. Hmm. Oh, 250, huh? Well, that's not too bad. Oh wait, is it now nighttime? That makes sense. Okay. Now we're making progress. Like what, 14 minutes in? Now we're making progress? Huh. And it, it goes through the um, text so quickly, I wasn't even sure if I hit the right thing, you know? Oh, I can't interact with those, can I? Okay. Let's go to the night dungeon. Hmm. <laughs> Slams. Oh, the slam hurt me. 
Why you gotta hurt me, Slim? Hmm. Oh, this makes sense. Hmm. I don't really need any of those. Well, let's see what's happening with this person. Hmm. Does the thing. Okay. Wait, what? Okay. So, how do I get to that? I guess I don't. It's a little messed up. Oh, wait. I do like the lighting effects. So yeah, this game got a little bit better as soon as I got to some actual progress. But it just wasn't very clear. I just kind of stumbled around until stuff happened. Which I think would be a, an issue with this game. But... It seems like it's a decent little time waster, so... If you're a fan of decent little time wasters, oh gosh, that was a lot. That hurt for a lot. Ugh. Okay. Okay, let's actually bring up, uh, where's my, um, here it is. No? Okay. Don't I have something I can use? Ah, here it is. Towards 25% of your total health. That seems good. <sighs> Floor traps just delay me. That's all they really do. 26428. I bet that's the um, combination to whatever that safe thing was earlier. I'm going to write it down. 26428. Okay. We'll test that theory later on. For now, let's kill some slims. Boom. Okay. Got him. Okay, this is kind of mildly, uh, eh. Well, this is, um, Shalnor Legends or whatnot. We'll play some more of it later on, but yeah, let me know in the comments below what you think. Hit that thumbs up, that share button, that subscribe button. Ring that little bell so you're notified whenever you have, whenever you want to know if we have a new video that comes out, that type of thing. It come out quite frequently. Just probably not on Saturdays and Sundays for the most part. Well, Mostly not on Sunday. But yeah. Hit that, ring that bell, hit like, share, etc. Subscribe. And until the next video comes out, you are now caught up. Morning, Maya.